shop. Hi there, welcome to TCM. Thanks for joining us. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. Up next today, a black and white classic from 1950 starring one of the screen's most colorful and iconic actors, tough guy James Cagney. Cagney was not a big man, maybe five, six or so on a tall day, but he was as tough as they come, an Irish-American kid from the streets of New York City. And starting in the early 1930s, Cagney sneered his way to fame, playing gritty gangsters and crime classics like The Roaring Twenties, The Public Enemy, and angels with dirty faces. But as all his fans know, James Cagney also had a completely different and decidedly softer side. He was a talented song and dance man. Matter of fact, Cagney won his only Oscar for his performance in a musical, Yankee Doodle Dandy. Coming up next, we've got the multi-talented James Cagney starring in one of his favorite musicals, released by Warner Brothers in 1950, The West Point Story. Cagney stars as a down-on-his-luck Broadway director who reluctantly accepts an offer to stage a show not on the bright lights of the Great White Way, but a hundred miles or so upstate at the U.S. Military Academy at West Point. Once Cagney arrives at the Academy, however, everything gets all foobar, to use my limited military jargon. The cast also includes Virginia Mayo and a couple of rising young stars on the Warner Brothers lot at the time, Doris Day and Gordon McRae from 1950 with some terrific songs by the team of Julie Stein and Sammy Kahn. Here's famous tough guy James Cagney singing and dancing his way through a role he later called one of his favorites, The West Point Story. 